Welcome back, angels. So today I'm using Indian Healing Clay, Freeman Black Sugar and Charcoal Scrub, and Be Fade Cream. Also, you're going to get a toner, and I'm using Witch Hazel. I'm applying all of this with a mask brush. And then, last but not least, a moisturizer. So, first I'm going to just start by mixing the Indian Healing Clay inside of a little bowl. And I'm mixing that with some vinegar. You want to get it to a nice thick consistency. And then apply that all over the face. So once that is all dry, I take about five to seven minutes to let that dry. I'm gonna take my coconut bar soap. Got a little hair on it, but I'm gonna take my coconut bar soap. I get this from a beauty supply store, and I'm just gonna wash all of this, all of this off my face. If you don't have um, coconut soap, you know, you can use Dove. I also use Dove. That's, that works too. So once that's all washed off your face, you're going to want to go in with the Freeman Charcoal and Black Sugar Scrub and wet your face and then apply that all over the face. So once all that is off, I'm going to go in with my toner and tone. Um, I didn't have a cotton ball, so I just, you know, winged it and used my hands. And this stuff feels so good once you tone your face after you've done a mask. It just has that cooling feeling. So you're going to want to make sure your toner is dry first before you apply this Ambi Fade Cream. And I'm just going to apply this all over my, well not all over my face, but mainly directly on my dark marks and under my eyes because I have um, dark circles under my eyes. And last but not least, I'm going to just moisturize. Um, I'm going in with some coconut oil because it's a light moisturizer, but if it was at nighttime, I would use some Andy ointment because it's a little bit heavier. Okay, and that is it. That is all I do. 
I hope y'all enjoyed this video. Like, comment, share, and subscribe. I'll see y'all in my next video.